up? Happy Vlogmas Day 16. My name is Sonali and today I finally decided to get ready because yesterday I was just like not feeling it. I wanted to straighten my hair today because um, I just haven't done it in so long, but then I decided to just put on makeup because why not? I think me and my dad are going to run errands after work and he said he wanted to buy like a leather jacket so we might go to Avalon. But it's kind of like rainy and gloomy outside today, so it's just not the prettiest day. But at least I'm getting outside my house because I feel like the past two days I've just been cooped up in my bedroom. Um, just like working and editing vlogs and all of that kind of stuff and watching The Bachelor. <laughs> Bachelorette, actually. I ate leftover Thai food for lunch and now... I have a webinar that I signed up for, um, for Like to Know It, which is the platform that I use to like get all my links and make a commission off of my links. So that is called Reward Style. It goes hand in hand with Like to Know It. Like to Know It is the app that you guys can use so you guys can have an account and look up all your favorite influencers and bloggers and on their profiles they post exactly what they're wearing you know their home decor um maybe similar items that look like it like dupes and everything but then reward style is kind of like the back end of like to know it like it's kind of just where you can see all of your analytics and obviously how much you have made on commissions and stuff like that so it's really really interesting if you guys are an influencer or trying to get into to that stuff i highly recommend to try to apply for reward style and get started as soon as you can because even if you don't have that many followers but the followers that you do have are very loyal maybe they will buy the things that you recommend so i do recommend starting early it also always helps to have a referral so if you guys need someone to refer you to the platform i'd be happy to do it just instagram dm me your email and make sure you're following me on instagram and yeah like i said i'll be happy to do it because i know it's not very easy to get into the reward style platform. I mean, I think it got harder over the years because when I applied, it was like years ago and I didn't really use it except for like maybe linking a few products here and there, but not like the like to know it app itself. I feel like I definitely should have started that long ago but if you guys are interested you can follow my profile it's literally just my instagram username but you just search it through the like to know it app and anyone can get the like to know it app so it is so underscore gnarly without the g and i'm just posting all my outfit links and all that fun stuff so go and follow me there and i'm gonna get on this webinar this is the fit i got my shop red dress coat on and then my abercrombie and fitch sweater honestly the best quality sweater i own because i've gotten just like sweaters in the past from boohoo and all those sites to be honest they're just trendy and not that great of quality then i got my splits 59 leggings and they look so good just like perfect and very flattering and then my air force ones My dad just went to the manor and we picked out Ryan a shirt for Christmas and a hat. Um, and then we went to an Indian market and I got samosas. They were so freaking good. But now I'm home and I need to ship out my boss's Christmas present. I got her a scratch off world map. I thought that would be really cool because she always talks about how she like wants to travel. Obviously she can't right now, but hopefully in the new year that can be something that she can do. And then obviously she can cross off all the countries she has been to on her little map. So I thought that was a cool gift. I feel like that's a really good present for all of the travel lovers out there. Um, but now I want to like just make a little card for her. I actually brought all of my little watercolor pens. I'll also link these down below. They are on Amazon and honestly for how many colors it comes with, it should be a lot more expensive. You can really just precisely color in and it can still look like watercolor. And you can actually like have a little brush. I think, I, did I bring it? Maybe not. Um, I usually just use like a makeup brush to like actually just blend it in. It's super cool. Then I have this pen, which I love. It's the Faber Castell Extra Small. It's almost like a marker, but like a really, really small marker. And then obviously got my tool pen. Ryan got me on these in high school. He was like obsessed with tool pens. And then obviously I got my... <laughs> 
Mary's Tea Mac Room um, pencils. I, if you guys didn't see my other vlog, I went to this restaurant and when we were writing like what we wanted because it was kind of like a dim sum situation where you write down everything, um, like the entree, dessert, everything like that. I swear I've never had better handwriting in my life and I have not written in so long because it's either I'm typing it on the computer or I'm like writing it on my iPad and I do not have the best handwriting when it comes to the iPad situation and I'm also getting a screen protector. I think it should be coming tonight so maybe I can put it on my iPad tonight but it's supposed to feel like paper and I also got an iPad pencil grip so hopefully that just makes handwriting a lot easier on the iPad and like procreate but for now I have these pencils and so hopefully it wasn't just the paper and hopefully it was actually the pencils because that's what, another thing I was worried about. It was kind of like interesting paper so that could have definitely been it. And then also I've been telling myself I need to write in my journal. It's this super cute peacock journal. It's actually like an Indian design because um, it has like Indian writing on it and everything but the paper on here is so like thick and like really really nice so I'm going to use this for manifestation in the new year. I want to start like ASAP but just well I tell myself I don't have time and then I just watch YouTube all day so I think the reason why I've been procrastinating about writing in that journal is because I want my handwriting to look perfect and like all the doodles I draw to look perfect because I want it to look pretty, but I know realistically not everything is gonna look, you know, amazing. <laughs> and there's just gonna be some mess ups. So I think I just need to get over that fear and just write in it finally. I also need to come up with what I am going to write in. I know it's gonna be just like about manifestation, but like specifically, you know? Right now I'm gonna go on Pinterest, find some inspiration, maybe like a holiday inspiration, and then do some sort of like graphic on the front and then I'll write her a little note. finished my boss's card and it looks like this from far away it looks good but up close it and um it could have used a little work but I don't do this very often I think it's just fun and like thoughtful to make you know cards that are handmade I guess I mean it looks kind of plain to be honest but I wrote a little something in there that is that I think me and Ryan are gonna get pizza for dinner that sounds really good. I honestly haven't had a major craving in a while, but pizza does sound pretty good today. We're at Your Pie and it's a pizza place. It's funny because I used to work at an actual pie shop and people would come in and ask for like pizza. And I'm just like, no, this is a pie shop. So I don't understand when people call pizza pie, but I guess it's just the thing. Look at Ryan in his new coat that I got him for Christmas, Patagonia. Super cute. Do you like it? Yeah, it's not as warm as Eddie Bauer, but it's uh, synthetic. So it doesn't leak feathers everywhere and stuff. Oh, and that's nice, because my yeah. North Face, like, it, <laughs> there's like feathers. What? Eddie Bauer one that's like, I pull my like, oh, uh, shit. everywhere out. That's funny. We'll show you guys our pizza when it comes out. Mm -hmm. What'd you get on your pizza? I got a pesto base, artichoke hearts, sun dried tomatoes, ham chicken. Interesting combination. I got a barbecue chicken pizza. Looks delish. Surprise! Ryan bought a Porsche. In my dreams. <laughs> yes, I will. Okay, nice. I'm saying? I want this it? car. Not that we have the Is money it for it, but it's cute. And it's so cool. You're so fast too. I think I have very expensive taste, unfortunately. We're at a car dealership and we're just looking at these cars. I don't get why they're open. Can you explain this to me? Yeah, I actually asked a guy one time why they're all unlocked. And uh -huh. he said that people break into cars and like homeless people sleep in them and stuff. Oh. So they'd rather them keep them unlocked so you can sit in them instead of breaking the windows for no reason. 
You can't okay. really mess it up inside if you just sit in it, you know? Jeez. That's weird mm -hmm. to think a homeless person could sleep in here. Where did you I didn't go? think about that. I, I mean, went to I guess, but it's still cold in here. But he showed me a car that he wanted to get. Jeep Grand Cherokee or something. Mm-hmm. So we'll see. With this or the Porsche? The Jeep Grand Cherokee or the Porsche? Um, obviously this, but like I said, What's the it's price? not like we can afford this. Price on it? This is seventy-two thousand dollars. This is used too. Think about a new one. This is used. Mm -hmm. It's a twenty twenty. Yeah, but it has four thousand miles on it. Oh shit! Sure. Well, damn. See, this is a newer screen. Isn't that better? Yeah, this is better. Looks more high tech. But I wouldn't have a something like this. Then it wouldn't have the lane assist, you know, the temperature cruise control. Less sun makes me less sleepy. It's true. It's almost night. I'm back at home and I'm in my freaking comfy pants and I'm just feeling so like cozy right now. I think I'm gonna turn on a candle and probably watch some YouTube videos. We went to look at cars and I was freezing outside. I was telling Ryan if I can see my own breath when I breathe, that means it's time to go inside. I was like freezing my butt off. I don't know how people do it in like the northern states. I know it's snowing in New York right now, which snow is fun. And like, obviously you just have to stay inside, I guess you just go plan it and you layer up. But I don't know, other than that, it's just, I hate the cold. And not that sweating is any better because obviously the cold's better for just like preserving makeup and hair and everything like that. But why do I look like a founding father right now? Please let me know. Um, but you know, the cold, it, I just don't like to shiver. Like it literally like hurts me and I know I think I'm being dramatic, but I also just hate sweating because that's so uncomfortable. And also <laughs> I remember in the mental all, like Chris Harrison made a joke about it being really hot and I never really noticed until the men, no, until hometown dates. And everyone was like sweating profusely while they were having these deep conversations. And it was just like, so like, could, could the producer not just like pat them down with a towel or something? Like it was just crazy how much they were sweating. I'm gonna end today's vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what else you guys wanna see in my Vlogmas videos because I'm kind of struggling coming up with ideas, especially like on these work days when I really can't do much else. I mean, I get off at four, so like I still have a little bit of daylight compared to some people, but still, I feel like I don't really have the whole day to just be doing fun things. Let me know and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.